Ya kwa eye afo mante wano suwa fwa wano bo eyo rwa jod bwa che wano na dewe tu jwa wache mse gana bae wa bwa juma ye pa e ba eye e ume suya ame muo ene apo mdi ense muo abambo te mwano manyasa nketwa si e sa mante wano wamo ti yenche edye nensu no tuwa na etu mpon upe nidi nse mi tu jwa wabra wamo eye nse nchwa fwa nse mwa that within a period of half and half years of the administration of the MPP the region has witnessed significant achievements which have positively impacted on the lives of our people, thereby consolidating the vision of His Excellency, the President of the Republic. The government flagship programs in agriculture, rules, trade and industry, rural, very urban and urban electrification, affordable housing, provision of logistics for security services, water and sanitation, and employment creation are working well and gaining momentum. I recall that during the period of the campaign to secure sufficient goods to justify the creation of the region, it was promised that the new regions will benefit from significant projects that will form the bedrock of development. The regions were also created to bring co governance closer to the people and give them a new experience with leadership. Currently, all the departments, institutions, and agencies are established and fully functional in the region. Therefore, citizens no longer have to travel long distances to Sunyane and other places to assess simple everyday services as hitherto was the case. I'm very glad and proud to say that the AFO experience is refreshing indeed. The government has since the creation of the AFO region embarked on a number of infrastructure initiatives to boost governance and improve administration of the region. These include ongoing work on the main regional coordinating council administration block in Gosso, which is at an advanced stage of completion. A three number residential accommodation for senior staff of the regional coordinating council at Gosso, which is completed and currently being inhabited. Ongoing construction of regional health uh, directorate and office complex at Hidim which is about 55% complete. Two number residential accommodation for health director and staff at Hidim, which has since been completed and handed over. Regional education directed and office complex and two number residential accommodation at Bichim have been completed and handed over to the regional education directorate.